it's hey hey and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you how i do my go-to style my go-to style um, on any bad hair day or just if i have an old hairstyle just like this this is an old twist out um, my go-to style for something like this would be a pineapple and so i'm going to show you how i achieve my pineapple all right guys let's get started All right, so I'm going to just spray the back of my hair with a little bit of water. All right, so this is water. So I'm kind of spraying it around the perimeters of my hair. So I'm gonna spray the perimeters of my hair. All right, and then I'm going to get my brush and I'm just gonna brush up. So this is actually a detangling brush simply because like I said, this is an old twist out. And so I don't wanna just go in and have like a hard brush that, uh, you know, that's brushing up into your hair. A detangling brush and then now that you've wet it, it's gonna just easily kind of like detangle the back and different stuff like that. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more water. All right. So usually with my pineapples, I like to, um, I like to have a little bit in my face. So now that I've kind of like gotten all of, um, you know, like all of this kind of like brushed up, Gonna get a little bit of my gel. I'm gonna put it up back here a little bit. Again, along the perimeters. Along the perimeters, along the edges. I'm gonna do that all around. And then, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get my regular brush. And I am just going to brush up. So I'm not gonna use my detangling brush for this simply because, um, again, I just put a little bit of the edge control. I'm sorry, not edge control. I meant to say gel. And I just use the Olive Oil Eco Styler Gel. And so I'm just gonna use a little bit of that. So I have my Eco Styler Gel on, and I'm just going to brush up my edges. All right, in the back perimeter of my hair. All right, so this front part right here, now that everything is brushed up, it's gonna make it a lot easier. So this front part right here, I'm gonna get one of my hair ties and I'm not gonna tie I'm literally just gonna put the hair tie over it. All right, so this is only if you want more of it in your face like this. And now we're gonna go ahead, gonna go back in. with your brush. All right. You are going to brush up. Make sure everything is sleek how you want it. And if you don't want it sleek, you don't necessarily um, even have to do that, honestly. All right, so I'm gonna get this. So this was actually um, a wide hair scrunchie and um, I usually cut mine because I don't like it too tight and I also don't like it too loose. So I cut it right there where you see um, the bottom, the ends are loose. And so I cut it simply because I want to be able to adjust how tight and how loose I want it for myself. And 
gonna go in. Again, you're not gonna do too tight because remember, especially if you have that part in the front that you want, you have that down some more. All right. So we're gonna go under there and you are just going to tie one time. Get those ends of the hair scrunchie. Again, this part is gonna be kind of more in your face simply because you put that scrunchie in on it. All right guys, and that is how I achieve my pineapple. For any old style that I may have that I'm ready to kind of let go of and I'm not ready to wash my hair just yet, I go in and I just use a little water, a little gel, and I go ahead and just put my hair in a pineapple and I let my hairstyle last me for a couple more days until wash day. All right, if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.